we're going to continue our discussion on the process for creating your own 100 day journal that's going to help you achieve your dreams. If you haven't already listened to the previous video that talks about the morning entry, please do that. I talk in that video about the journal and uh, just the setup for getting ready for your journaling exercise. So in the evening, you've already gone through your day, you've checked everything off that you've um, finished from the morning, and as you're wrapping up your night in the evening, the first thing you want to do is write down, I like to call it things that made my day sparkle. And I leave two or three lines just to talk about the cool things that happened during the day. And then I leave two lines for, this is how I'll make tomorrow even better. Now you can change those, whatever resonates with you, but those things really stuck with me. And then I give myself a rating system on a scale of one to five on how I lived that day. And the four things that are most important to me that I rate are how connected to my family was I, how present was I, and the, I've got to look at my journal, I can't remember. Yep, self-care. How did I do with self-care and how was my money mindset? So I just have a scale of one through five and I'll circle how I did on those four categories. And then, and this is just so much fun, I hope you include this in your evening journal, I have a line that says, am I closer to my goals today than I was yesterday? And I have a checkbox, yes or no. And I have to tell you, I always end up being able to check yes. And that's just really empowering. Even if you just take one tiny baby step, make one phone call, have one conversation, you're moving yourself forward towards your goals and dreams. And then at the bottom, my thoughts about today. And so it's just a little reflective space where I can share anything that's on my mind about the day. Just takes 10 minutes, keeps me focused, and sometimes if I think about, let's say self-care, you know, um, skipping the gym or eating something that's maybe not healthy, I'll, I'll remember, oh, I'm gonna have to give myself a lower self-care self score if I do that. And it is incredibly motivating to make some good choices. So that's my evening journal um, exercise. If you would like to get pictures of my journal entries, morning and evening, I'm more than happy to share them with you. Just shoot me a note at Carla at the professionalwomansmentor.com or add your email address in the comments below and I'll be happy to send it to you. I hope you enjoy your journaling and it moves you forward towards your goals and dreams the way that it has for me.